Place Dead, we rehome over 300 dogs a year. There's a dog for everyone here. Lap dogs. Excited dogs. Pedigree dogs. Old dogs. home any of our dogs without the support from hundreds of people who decide to adopt a dog rather than buy a puppy. You might come in looking for a young Labrador, but you might fall in love with an old lurcher like Shabby here. Here's our quick guide to finding the right dog for you. As you can see, not all rescue dogs are troubled, badly behaved or old. We'll tell you everything you need to know about the dog. Just come in and see us. You never know who you'll fall for. Do you like jogging before bedtime? There's no point getting a dog that needs a four hour run every day if your idea of exercise is a walk to the corner shop. Come on, Molly. A dog's personality and its previous experiences will affect how a dog reacts to things in life. By spending time with them before you take them home, you'll get to know what to expect from them. People tend to worry that rescue dogs are all going to be staffies and dogs with behaviour problems. Um, but as you can see, we get all sorts of dogs here at Raystead. Even fun, sought after breeds, just like little Poppy here. She was a stray. <laughs> Poppy. Uh, she'd been used for breeding. Um, and, uh, and the owners probably bred her, uh, sold her puppies and then decided they didn't want her anymore um, and let her go to stray. I chose greyhounds as a breed because I'm lazy and they're the perfect dog for me. <laughs> um, they don't need a lot of exercise, unlike um, what a lot of people think. Um, and when you see them racing around the track, they're not really like that. They're like short bursts of exercise and the rest of the day they're quite happy to be on the sofa with their feet up. I probably wouldn't get a German Shepherd or a Husky or Why? a Malamute. Why not? Uh, because they're quite big and require a lot of training. So Sarah, this is your dog Gromit, isn't it? And yeah. she is a Jack Russell Terrier, is that right? That's right, yeah. And why did you choose her? Um, well, I grew up with a Jack Russell as a little child and they've always been my favourite dog. And does she need a lot of exercise? She likes to have a lot of exercise. She's certainly got a lot of energy. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm, oh, I'm going to put her down. <laughs> is there any breed you wouldn't choose if you were choosing a dog again? I personally wouldn't get a dog that required a lot of grooming. I like a dog that's got a fairly easy coat to look after and easy to keep clean. Yeah, this is Milo and he's six months old and a pug cross shih tzu. Why did you choose pug cro cross shih tzu? Just because I think they're cute. You like a cute dog? <laughs> yeah, squashed up face. Oh. Choosing a dog that's right for you is like dating. You just need to find the right match, which makes Raystead your dating agency. Do you work during the day? Do you live in the countryside or a built up area? Do you have a cat or other animals at home? Or children? Will they all get along? None of this means you can't have a dog. It's just about choosing the right one for you.